Hello and welcome to this new video on how to publish your Power Apps application. So if you're happy with your changes to your app and you're, you're ready to go, then you might want to actually publish it so that other people can use it. Also keep in mind, um, if you haven't made any changes to it, then it won't ask you to save it. So for example, here, there's no save option showing here. But if I were to, for example, add a new screen, now if I come up here, it's asking me to save it. So at that point, if I save it, it will then say publish. So to publish your app, it's just as simple as clicking this button here and then say publish this version. And that's it. That's all there is to it. Now you've also got a button here that says see all versions. So if I click that, that's going to show me all the versions that I've published for this particular application. And the one I just did, it's got a little symbol here that says live. So that's the current one that I just published. And these are all the previous versions of that app. So next to each of these versions, you've got these little three dots. So if I clicked on this one, for example, and here you get an option that says restore. So if I restore this one, then that's going to replace this one that says live. So this is version 11. So if I restore it, so if I restore it, it says this will be saved as version 13. And it says restore succeeded and we have version 13. So although we've published this live one, um, the one that we can work on is version 13. Now when you publish, you might want to share the app to different people, different users within your organization. So come back to publish, publish the version, and you can now share. So I'm the owner of this app, so I'm automatically shown there. But if I wanted to add others, I just come up here and type in a name. Now keep in mind, all of these people have to have Power Apps accounts. And it just lists the connectors in here, which they're going to need permission to. So you don't need to do anything here, really. Just ignore that. You can make them a co-owner, and that's going to allow them to edit and share the app but not delete or change owner. But generally, if it's for a user who just wants to view the app and enter data, you just leave things as they are. And then you just click on the share button here. And that shares out the app to the user. And you can add as many users as you want. So I hope that's given you an idea of how to publish your Power Apps application. If you like this video, please click the button to like it or why not subscribe to my channel? Or you can even download my free Power Apps for Newbies book at www.powerappsfornewbies.com.